So guys, you join me as I clean the fish. I want you to join me as I clean the fish. We're going to dry this fish together, guys. I'm going to put it in the oven. I'm going to dry them together. I want to cut and dry. I'll cut them and dry. So guys, check this out. Usually some people don't eat the head, it's optional if you want, you can also add up the head, most people don't like eating the head. Let's do this together guys. Lies dried fish. You can cut the size however you want. Nice. I'm cutting the last one now. Cutting the last one. Cleaning and cutting. So we are doing this together guys, cutting and drying the fish together, it's going to be very delicious guys, and tasty, I'm going to be washing them now. Before we set it inside the oven, let's do this together, reduce the strength of the top, reduce this, then we are going to clean together, guys. After this, we are going to be adding the seasoning. We're going to be adding the seasoning. So, and put in the oven. Usually, when you lubricate it very well, it goes into it. Some prefer, people prefer to go with just salt alone. You know, but I'm going to be adding a little other. Guys, you need to clean it very well. Clean it very, very well. So we're still cleaning. We're about to finish cleaning now. So then I'll season it. I'm really Season it very well and I put in the oven. Guys, just watch it when you taste it. Like I said before, if you love out the head, you can use the head too. 
And some people they cut it out and some people this is the best part they like almost finished cleaning this guy's dried fish very good for cooking so we are still cleaning guys we are cleaning guys we are cleaning guys Cleaning the head is a bit uh, difficult, but if you know the way, the method of cleaning it, it's easy for you, very, very easy for you. So guys, I'm still cleaning. I'll soon be through. I'll have to clean it a second time. Welcome back guys, so we are going to almost the final stage of this So this is the second time I am cleaning the fish And then um, We are going to be seasoning them right away Second time, guys, playing the fish. Just it for the last time. I will season them and take straight to the oven. So guys, this is salt. I'll be using salt first to season this. You already know the amount of salt that you would like to, uh, know, to add. So, first stage, I think this sauce is just okay. Then the second I'll be using is the Maggi, non Maggi. I'm going to be mess, massaging it with all these ingredients. The third I will just apply is curry. Sometimes you can apply blended pepper depending on what you want to use it for. That makes it snacky. But today I won't be adding pepper. So now we'll start with the lubrication. That is messaging the ingredients into it. Go in. Guys, are you with me? <laughs> So we have to do this so that we don't just leave the ignorance spreading. Everything will go in. We are using the same pan. Doesn't matter. So as I'm doing it now, the salt is going in. The maggi is going in. All the ingredients are going in very well.
Guys, are you with me? Can you see this? I'm going to be showing you the end result. This one is dried. Guys, are you with me? <laughs> okay. Allowing everything to go in properly. So guys, I'm sending it straight into the oven now, well spaced. Or about 45 minutes, so come with me guys, let's go. Guys, you can see it's really coming out good in the oven. Can't wait. It's, it's all ready. It's all already dry, tasty, and so rich. That is it, guys.